Hello, well, greetings. This is Gilles Monsignon, and I uh, thought I would come and say hello today. I hope you're having a wonderful day. For every day has to be marvelous, has to be uh, better than any, any other day. It has to be uh, a, a cause for celebration. Uh, and so, uh, because in, in many sense, we said this life is not real. It is an illusion that's created by the senses, and, and in many sense, it is true, for it is just a projection of our super consciousness so that we can participate. But there is a great deal of meaning and significance in the relationship to our to our being here in this physical body, for this uh, this first physical body, once once we attain a higher state of consciousness, a Buddhist, Buddha, Buddha state of consciousness, or or Christ state of consciousness, the body becomes an incredible, marvelous temple for the spirit uh, and the soul. Uh, but in a sense, for now, the the, the there is many things that we have not yet uh, come into uh, understanding about ourselves, about our body. I, in many sense, the ego is the lo lowest octave of the spirit. Then there is the sun above, the soul, soul frequency. As we return to the solar frequency level, we reintegrate the soul frequency. Uh, and then above, there is the God self. Uh, in many sense, our body is a, is a chemical factory. It responds to our emotions, our uh, released our chemical process, and, and then it releases those chemicals into our blood, and that gives us those emotions and sensations. Um, so, so in, in many, not the emotion, but the, the, the feeling sense of it within the body. Uh, and so, in many sense, we won't have love to flow through our, our, our vein all the time. This is love, 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 love and light. So, so we can elevate our frequency. Um, it, it is. It, it is it is dangerous to, um, although it's something we do, but it is dangerous to depend on external substances to create those chemical reactions. Uh, I'll take the example of adrenaline. We can create adrenaline to, that wakes us up, but then when you drew, drink coffee or take pharmaceutical like uh, cocaine or something like that, it brings a lot of adrenaline. But even coffee is very, uh, is a very uh, subtle thing, but it's, uh, so it's better to create the adrenaline, to learn to create the adrenaline. Same thing with dopamine or, or, or serotonin. Um, Serotonin. There is a big problem in America with um, pharmaceutical uh, opiacé. With uh, there are a lot of people are becoming addicted to this uh, um, serotonin. But the body is completely capable of creating once we discover this inner pharmacy to 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 create what we need when we need it. Uh, just like endorphins, uh, there is many endorphins, very complex molecule. Um, but the, the, those are happiness, happiness molecule. The, when when the body, the brain creates it, we just move into happiness, and so. Um, so we can, but if we take substance to, to achieve that, the body loses its ability to create it naturally and, and becomes addicted to the substance. So it is very it is very important to learn to create that naturally. Although the body creates all those things naturally, like such as oxytocin, which is a bonding molecule, or, or melatonin when we need to fall asleep. Uh, but the most interesting of all is, is called uh, demetriltryptamine. It is it is a it is a molecule that creates the light within dreams that uh, that is created by the brain, and so we, we want to. It connects us to higher planes of consciousness, and so when we move into a gamma state of consciousness, the, the body produces a lot more demetriltryptamine. Uh, so in many sense, we want to surrender to love. We, we want we want love to flow, to flow through, and to connect to that energy, to let go of, of thoughts, to just uh, move into a feeling state and breathe, uh, just to allow ourselves to, to move into a state of grace, a state of well-being. Um, in many sense, I've, I've been saying to maybe it's good to, to seek to return to, to this paradise. What is paradise? Paradise is many things. In mythology, it is the highest state of. Uh, of possible reality that we can achieve, uh, but uh, for me it is the central isle of light and life, it is the eternal home of the eternal gods and it is the center of infinity, it is quite far in the physical space in relation to the galaxy. But there is an inner connection through the heart, we are all connected to this inner plane of reality. And as we ascend, we, we are moving from uh, from um, f from f f uh, through the universe. We are slowly but surely losing this animalistic aspect of our nature. We move through the super universe. We become more spiritual, and then we have to traverse the central universe, the original, perfect, divine universe of source called Avona, before we reach this this central isle of light. It is part of the pro program process. And when we encounter those beings, those Avona, those eternal beings that were created at the origin, at the, as the central pop population of the central universe, we, we discover that they have between 45 to 70 different senses 
which we have only five and six with the intuition. So our, sense, our, our perception, slowly as we ascend, we will discover new senses, new abilities, new perception. And um, this population of Avona is, is we, we don't really know what will be the future of Avona because a lot of the population have been going towards paradise to move into the corp of finality. And many, many have moved also to the other seven un super universe to participate in the evolution of time and space. But we don't think that they will be totally depopulated. The great mystery about those planets is that there is a there is an eternal of days that have been stationed on each of the one billion perfect sphere of Avona when those are super administrators. But but they are absolutely no need in this present day and age for such a, such a being to be present on those sphere. So those will, will be mysteries that will be unfolding in the future. In many sense, we have to to become a clear vessel in order to to uh, to, to receive to 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 be more uh, to, to to allow more of the, the higher self to to. Uh, to come into uh, to come into perspective and consciousness, we have to understand that all our desires are created by source. In, in many sense, if there really was no desire, there would be no expansion. There would be no everything comes from source. But they are very uh, so. All those desires, when when you have a desire within yourself, is because God believes that you're going to be able to fulfill it. And then God is also the one that creates the obstacle on the way to the fulfillment of the desire. So it's all you. It's in a sense, it's not God Himself. It's your program with God. With your, with your source, with your creator. So, but every obstacle that's put in the way, the source knows that you can overcome it. Otherwise, it, we, can ne we are never presented with a situation that we cannot face. For that is the part of the wisdom of life. So anything that we face, anything that we desire, we can achieve. Anything that we face, we can overcome. So this is a powerful understanding to, to keep in mind. Um, and, and in many sense, we want to meet spirit, we want to meet God beyond the world of thoughts. It, there is a great philosopher named Plotin, I'm studying right now, a third century uh, uh, after Christ. Um, I wanted to say, all this, I spoke of the sacred flame in my past video, the, the sacred fire, the, the, the source the soul fire uh, and this realization happens through the third eye all those things have to happen the third eye has to open the, and that's why demetriltryptamine is very important to keep this third eye this, this pineal gland open so that you can receive the light and, and um, and begin to see and work more efficiently with all those uh, those flames. I also wanted to say in terms of the white light, the white light of Creator includes all spec all frequencies and spectrums of light, even hidden part. But there are some that are very very little, and there are certain colors that are more abundant within that world to make that white light. So those things will be also um, will come to realize them when it is uh, the time. And so, uh, it, because in many sense we we don't know anything. Uh, no matter where we are, there is always so much more to know. So we, we have to, to, to embrace destiny, to try to become one with ourselves, one with our planet, one with our sun and solar system, one with our galaxy, one with our universe, one with our creator, our source. And, and so the more we are able to do that, the, the easier life, uh, we're, we're, the more we'll be able to integrate that and, and, and bring find meaning into our life as well as to, to enjoy higher values as well. Um, the card of the day is trust. You have to trust. Trust, trusting, we have to trust. It's yeah, just like the, you know, jumping, jumping out of a plane. To trust the parachute will open. When, when we have to make a leap of faith, we have to trust. There will be something there to support us. It is a matter of faith, trust, and flow. So it is very important. Continue to trust, and uh, and, uh, and I'm sure that. Uh, the, this, the trust is always rewarded every time we make one step towards the universe. The universe makes a hundred step or ten step towards us. It's a hundred even. I'm going to finish with a little song. It's a song by Alison Cross from a movie uh, called Oh Brother. Just like this. Wish I had a choral. We might come and some music. But uh, I'm doing this for now. As I went down in the river to pray, studying about that good old way, and who shall wear the starry crown? Good Lord, show me the way. Oh, sister, let's go down. Come on down. Come, let's go down. Oh, sister, let's go down. Down in the river to pray. As I went down in the river to pray, studying about that good old way, and who shall wear the rope and crown? Good Lord, show me the way. Oh, brothers, let's go down. Come on down, won't you want to go down? Oh, brother, let's go down, down in the river to pray. 
As I went down in the river to pray, studying about that good old way, and who shall wear story crown, good Lord, show me the way. Oh, fathers, let's go down, let's go down, come on down. Oh, fathers, let's go down, down in the river to pray. As I went down in the river to pray, studying about that good old way, and who shall wear story crown, good Lord, show me the way. Oh, Moses, let's go down, let's go down, don't you want to come down? Oh, Moses, let's go down, down in the river to pray. As I went down in the river to pray, studying about that good old way, and who shall wear the starry crown, good Lord, show me the way. Oh, sinners, let's go down, come on down, won't you want to come down? Oh, sinners, let's go down, down in the river to pray. As I went down in the river to pray, studying about that good old way, and who shall wear the robe and crown, good Lord, show me the way. Well, thank you. Let's hope the good Lord show us the way each and every day, um, each and every moment. Let us be one with, uh, with all that is and enjoy uh, all that life has to offer. I wish you a wonderful day. Namaste. Thank you very much.